Hello, everybody. Welcome back. Yes, welcome back. I apologize. There might be some blank spots. We kind of just edited a lot of stuff out from the last episode, so bear with us. Yeah. Oh, it's kind of common. Yeah. That kind of sounds like thrift shop. The radio edit. Yeah, well, the radio edit, there's probably 30 seconds of just blank. It's better than the Kids Bob version. <laughs> oh, you like that song? Let's take it and fuck it up really badly. Prepare your anus. That tongue going. You know what I mean. You know what it's talking about. Well, you're not going to. I did earlier. Yeah, and then you um, automatically started talking about Ma, so... Our crazy Asian rapist friend. Awesome. In case any of uh, you are wondering if we're actually talking about her mother. No, no. we're not. Yes. Yeah, she... She's a rapist. Nothing special about her. Only sometimes. What did I tell you? Suicide bombers. You can't. You can never look at anything the same way again. <laughs> you just start to question reality when I hang out with you, basically. I mean, last night was quite interesting. That probably is what hell is, I mean. Think about it. Just nothing for eternity. Uh, it depends on what you think, yeah. Well, if I had to believe in a hell, I think it'd be nice. Yeah, well, yeah, I mean, I fear not hell, I'll be in good company when I get there. But yeah! And all I can think is, it's all like, Manana, tomorrow I shall succeed! Congrats. Wily Coyote, super genius. Well, you know what, Kenley, you know what I've learned? As long as your legs don't stop moving, you'll make it to the other side of that empty gorge. You only fall once you stop running. I mean, that is a very honest and fun philosophy to live by. When the going gets tough, don't look down, and you won't fall. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you, you kind of signed off for that when you asked me to come over and do it with you. And you're the one that complains that I make sex jokes around you? That's all I can think of them screaming when they go running towards you, blinking. For Canaan Country!
So, Jason asks me to kill people for him, and now you're starting? Great, my schedule is gonna never be open. Yeah. Damn you, Milton Bradley! It was as simple as that. Not, not good at taking the simple route. Edit that. Why? Super plus like. Uh, I don't know. I suppose the answer varies depending on the person asking that question. You know that time when you're sitting home alone and you feel something brush up against you and there's nothing there? Did you think it was your imagination? <laughs> it wasn't. Oh, I'm not gonna incriminate myself. I'm not gonna incriminate myself, I plead the fifth. <laughs> I plead the fifth, aka I'm guilty, but I'm going to use the constitution to hide. Yes. Damn right, this is America. America. Well... Yeah, you were supposed to go in the green. Yeah. This is the one you just went through and died, like, twice. You got the green. You're supposed to go left. I'm not good at things, Elliot. I'm not good at life. Oh, well, it's better than the Michael J. Fox show is coming out. It's gonna be bad. I mean, it's from the commercial. He's trying to ladle up dinner, and his hand won't stop shaking. And all of a sudden, one of the people at the table just goes, "You know what? This is a personal victory. Good for you, but give me the spoon. We're hungry." <laughs> and it's gonna be funny, but I. It's horrible, and me saying it's horrible means it's gonna be pretty damn bad, I mean. <laughs> I, 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 I got the thing, guys. I'm gonna get the thing. Guys, guys, I got the thing. Damn it, Moon Moon! Who the fuck invited Moon Moon? Shit! <laughs> 